Um, as Jim mentioned, I'm on maternity leave at the moment, so uh, Gabriel will be my hopefully silent partner in this uh, enterprise. Uh, you don't wake a sleeping baby. Um, so, so technology and artificial intelligence has been and will transform our world and can do so as a great force for good. But there is absolutely no doubt that regulation has not kept pace with the change in these technologies. And that is incredibly important because we need to have those structures and those rules. And whether it is the recruitment algorithm that is entrenching the existing bias and discrimination against women, against ethnic minorities, whether it's the YouTube uh, autoplay that shows inappropriate content after Peppa Pig. We do need to have better regulation. And as a legislator and policymaker, I am really committed to us finding how we can develop those answers to better regulate these new technologies. But I'm also very aware of the limits of regulation. Regulation takes time when you're passing laws, even guidance and secondary regulations in Parliament, that process can take years. Also, regulation tends to be very prescriptive. Now, that can be really helpful if you want to be saying, this is the amount that the minimum wage should be, so that nobody is in any doubt. But with the myriad of different uh, ways that technology is implementing solutions, regulation cannot possibly capture all of the different issues that may well become a problem. So my proposal is that we need to have designed in from the beginning an ethical approach to data science and artificial intelligence. I think we should have a code of ethics. Much like when you go to the doctor or you rock up to the hospital or accident and emergency, you know that you will be treated by a doctor who has signed up to the Hippocratic Oath. As well as their training and their exams, they have got a set of principles that they have uh, sworn that they will abide by. And I think to have a similar type of uh, code of ethics for those involved in programming, in data science, would be a good way to embed those principles at an early stage. Uh, Harry suggested it was about competence when people are designing their uh, artificial intelligence uh, programs that, uh, that, that lead to those problems. Well, it could be competence, it could be about whether or not people are being careful enough, it could be about whether or not the issues that people should be looking for are properly defined. I think the issues of transparency are incredibly important because without transparency it is very difficult to have accountability. If we're going to have those driverless cars, we need to know what happens when there is an accident, when somebody uh, loses their life as a result, how and who is held accountable for that? What are the decisions that go into that and that are made? We need to be able to understand what has gone on, what has happened. Privacy is another incredibly important principle, and we are now much more aware of it with uh, the, the advent of GDPR. Uh, and fairness is also vital. So those key principles need to be embedded in a code of ethics, and I propose that that should be called the Lovelace Code of Ethics. Thank you very much.